Hi guys, welcome back to Tax Q and A. In today's video, I'll answer some of the most common questions people have while filing their taxes on Quico. Let's get started. Rahul asks, "Is Quico safe to file ITR?" It's a valid question. Filing your ITR means sharing sensitive personal and financial information, so it's only fair to ask how safe your data is. At Quico, data security is something we take very seriously. First, we are registered with the income tax department as an e-return intermediary or an ERI, which means we are officially authorized to file returns on your behalf. On top of that, we follow industry standard security protocols, maintain the latest ISO certifications, and go through regular audits to make sure your data stays secure at every step. Shreya is asking, "I have to file ITR too. Where can I select the ITR form while filing on Quico?" You do not have to manually select the ITR form on Quico. We have simplified that for you. As you go through the filing process and enter your income details, we automatically determine and apply the correct ITR form based on your situation. For example, if you report short-term capital gains, we'll select ITR 2 for you. If you later add business income, we'll switch it to ITR 3. So you focus on entering your details. We'll take care of choosing the right form. Vineet says, "I switched jobs midway through the year. How do I add multiple form 16s on Quico?" You can upload as many form 16s as you need on Quico. Go to the salary section and click on add salary then choose the upload form 16 option. Upload the form 16 from one of your employers, verify the details and click save and continue. Then click on the add button and repeat the same steps for your other form 16s. That's it. We'll take care of the rest. Isha is asking, I have 15 lakh salary, some tax saving investments and a home loan going on. How to compare which regime is better for me on Quico and where to switch regimes? See, choosing the right tax regime matters. You don't want to find out later that you could have saved more by simply picking the other one. On Quico, the new regime is selected by default since it benefits most taxpayers. But as you start adding your income and deductions, we automatically calculate which regime gives you lower tax. So once all your income details are in, click on View Tax Computation at the bottom. Then head to the regime analyzer tab. You will see a side by side comparison of your tax under both regimes. Pick the one that works best for you and that's it. You can also switch regimes any time in the additional details section. To now last is Quico free to use. Quico follows a freemium model and in fact more than 50% of our DIY users filed their taxes without paying anything last year. If your total income is under 10 lakh and you earn from salary, rent or bank interest, you can most likely file for free. You only need to upgrade if you have more complex needs like income from FNO, crypto, foreign assets or if you trade across multiple broker apps. You can find all the details on our pricing page. Vaibhav says, for the past financial year I was an NRI. Where to change residential status? You can update your residential status from the my profile page on Quico. Head there, click edit and change your status. If you are unsure whether you qualify as an NRI or a resident for tax purposes, we have linked a tax queen post in the description. So give it a quick read before updating. And with that, it's a wrap. If Google search is too much work for you, Quora is full of opinions, and ChatGPT is not accurate enough, then you should check out Tax Q and A, where you can toss questions and our tax experts give quality answers. And hey, don't forget to like and subscribe so you do not miss out on what's coming next. See you in the next one.